topic because of you I'm not scared, I'm no worried He said who did me name from January Me near to you I read When the cool evening breezes were blowing The man and his wife heard the Lord God walking about in the garden So they hid from the Lord God among the trees Then the Lord God called to the man Where are you? He replied, I heard you walking in the garden, so I hid. I was afraid because I was naked. Who told you that you were naked? The Lord God asked, Have you eaten from the tree whose fruit I commanded you not to eat? The man replied, It was the woman. You gave me who gave me the fruit and I ate it. Then the Lord God asked the woman, What have you done? The serpent deceived me, she replied. That is why I ate it. Then the Lord God said to the serpent, Because you have done this, you are cursed more than all animals, domestic and wild. You will crawl on your belly, groveling in the dust as long as you live. Verse 15. And I will cause hostility between you and the woman, and between your offspring and her offspring. He will strike your head, and you will strike his heel. Verse 17. And to the man he said, Since you listened to your wife and ate from the tree whose fruit I commanded you not to eat, the ground is cursed because of you. All your life you will struggle to scratch a living from it. Verse 18. And the last verse. It will grow thorns and thistles for you, though you will eat of eight grains. May his name be praised. Amen. The stars are bright and shining. It is the night of our dear Savior's birth. Long lay the world in sin and narrow pining till he appeared and the soul felt it was a thrill of hope. The very world rejoices for joy and the praise a new and glorious morn fall on your knees oh he the angels voices oh now Christ 
was born on nine to find on nine on nine divine oh Brings the weary world rejoices a thrill of hope, a new and glorious morn fall on your knees. Christ was born on nine divine on nine on nine divine on nine divine From the book of Genesis chapter 22 reading from verse 15 to 18 <clears throat> Genesis 22 15 to 18 the angel of the Lord appeared to Abraham from heaven a second time I make a vow by my own name the Lord is speaking that I will richly bless you because you did this and did not keep back your only son from me I promise that I will give you as many descendants as there are stars in the sky or grains of sand along the seashore. Your descendants will conquer their enemies. All the nations will ask me to bless them as I have blessed your descendants, all because you have obeyed my command. All the nations will ask me to bless them as I have blessed your descendants, all because you have obeyed my command. Amen. Holy night, all is calm, all is bright, round young bed in my the rank child, holy infant, so ten the red mouth, sleeping evil in peace, he's sleeping evil in Infant so tender and holy, infant so tender and mild. Sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. Silence. 
Silence night. Silence night. Holy night. Holy night. Shepherds quake at the sight. Shepherds quake at the sight. Glory streams from heaven are found. Glory streams from heaven are found. Evelyn hosts sing hallelujah. Evelyn hosts sing hallelujah. Christ the Savior is born. Christ the Savior is born. Silent night. Silent night. Holy night. Son of God. Son of God. Love your life. Radiant beams from the holy face. Radiant beams from thy holy face. Where the dawn of redeeming grace. Jesus, Lord. At thy bed. Jesus, Lord, at thy bed. Yeah. Jesus, Lord, at thy bed. Jesus, Lord, at thy bed. Jesus, Lord, at thy bed. Yeah. Jesus, Lord, at thy bed. Our third scripture reading is taken from the book of Isaiah chapter 9 verse 2 6 to 7 Isaiah chapter 9 verse 2 6 to 7 the people that walk in darkness have seen a great light they that dwell in the land of the shadow of death upon them has the light shined for unto us a child is born unto us a son is given and the government shall be upon his shoulder and his name shall be called wonderful counselor the mighty god the everlasting father the prince of peace of the increase of his government and peace there shall be no end upon the throne of david and upon his kingdom to order it and to establish it with judgment and with justice from henceforth even forever the zeal of the lord of hosts will perform this the lord bless the reading of his word to serve us with the song entitled wonderful merciful savior with a clap offering let's welcome our fire melodians Savior, 
precious Redeemer and friend. Who would have thought that a lamb could rescue the souls of men? Oh, you rescue the souls of Salah comfort our keeper. Spirit, we long to embrace. You offer hope when our hearts are hopelessly lost away. Oh, we've hopelessly lost our way. with 
always thank God for. Revelations chapter 22, verse 10, verse 16. Revelations chapter 22, verse 16. I, Jesus, have sent my angel to testify unto the churches. I am the root and the offspring of David. I am the bright morning star. Amen. To serve us with our fourth scripture reading for the night, precious ones, you want to help me with the class clap offering as we welcome our dickness, Julie. Hallelujah. Our fourth scripture reading is taken from Micah chapter 5, from verse 2 to 4. But you, O Bethlehem Ephrata, are only a small village among all the people of Judah, yet a ruler of Israel, whose origin are in the distance past will come from you on my behalf. Verse 3. The people of Israel will be abandoned to their enemies until the woman in labor gives birth. Then at last his fellow countrymen will return from exile to their own land. Verse 4. And he will stand to lead his flock with the Lord's strength in the majesty of the name of the Lord his God. Then his people will live there undisturbed, for he will be highly honored around the world. Amen. Once in royal David city stood a lowly cattle shed where mother lay her baby in a manger for his bed. Mary was that mother mouth, Jesus Christ, her little child.
for the child so dear and gentle is our Lord in heaven above and he leaves his children on to the place where he is scripture reading shall be taken from the book of Matthew chapter 1 verses 18 to 23 and I read verse 18 now the birth of Jesus Christ was on this wise when as his mother Mary was espoused to Joseph before they came together she was found with a child of the Holy Ghost verse 19 then Joseph her husband being a just man and not willing to make her a public example was minded to put her away privately. Verse 20. But while he thought on these things, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a dream, saying, Joseph, thou son of David, fear not to take thee Mary thy wife, for that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Ghost. Verse 21. And she shall bring forth a son, and thou shalt call his name Jesus, for he shall save his people from their sins. Verse 22. Now all this was done, that it might be fulfilled which was spoken of the Lord by the prophets, saying, verse 23, Behold, a virgin shall be with child, and shall bring forth a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel. Come and behold him 
upon the King of angels. Oh, come, let us adore Him. 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 Oh, come, 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 adore him. Oh, come, oh, come, let us adore him. Oh, come, let us adore him. Oh, come. is worthy for him alone is worthy for him him, him alone is worthy he is for him alone for him Let us adore him. Oh, come, let us adore him. Oh, come, 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 adore him. Christ the Lord. Amen. Our seat reading is taken from. St. Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 7, and I read, And it came to pass in those days that there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed. And this taxing was first made when Cyrenius was governor of Syria, and all went to be taxed, everyone into his own city. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, out of the city of Nazareth, into Judea, unto the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David. Verse 5. To be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife, being great with child. And so it was that while they were there, the days were accomplished that she should be delivered. Verse 7. And she brought forth her firstborn son and wrapped him in a swaddling dress and laid him in a manger because there was no room for them in the inn. This is the word of God. Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Long time ago in Bethlehem, so the Holy Bible says, Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. Long time ago in Bethlehem, so the Holy Bible says, Mary's boy child, Jesus Christ, was born on Christmas Day. Hark, hark, lying, the angels sing, a king was born today. And man will live forevermore because of Christmas.
Wash up as what we are flocks by night. They see a bright new shine star. And they hear choir sing a song. Music seems to come from afar. While shepherds watch their flocks by night, they see a star bright in star. They hear a choir sing a song. The music seems to come from afar. First Timothy chapter two verse five. First Timothy, Timothy chapter two verse five. Etrimi enu chiche munum. For there is one God. Ose na nyangu pamo ba kope. And one mediator. Ane ni a ojina muma ya ba kope. Between God and men. Ojina tama nyangu pamo ni nipa. The man Christ Jesus. Obe manu eni Jesus Christo. Amen. Amen. We want to enjoy our seventh scriptural reading. Precious ones with a clap offering. You want to help me welcome our minister Erica. Do it better for her. The seventh reading is taken from the book of Luke, chapter 2, verse 8 to 20. And I read That night there were shepherds staying in the fields nearby guiding their flocks of sheep. Suddenly, an angel of the Lord appeared among them, and the radiance of the Lord's glory surrounded them. They were terrified. But the angel reassured them, don't be afraid, he said. I bring you good news that will bring great joy to all people. The Savior, yes, the Messiah, the Lord, has been born today in Bethlehem, the city of David. And you will recognize him by this sign. You will find a baby wrapped, smuggled in a cloth, lying in a manger. Suddenly, the angel was joined by a vast host of others, the armies of heaven, praising God and saying, Glory to God in highest heaven, and peace on earth to those whom God is pleased. When the angel had returned to heaven, the sheep said to each other, Let's go to Bethlehem. Let's see this thing that has happened, which the Lord has told us about. They hurried to the village and found Mary and Joseph. 
And there was a baby lying in a manger. After seeing him, the shepherds told everyone what has happened and what the angel had said to them about this child. All who heard this shepherd's story were astonished. But Mary kept all these things in her heart and thought about them often. The shepherds went back to their flocks, glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen. It was just as the angel has told them. This is the word of God. Glory to God. Ah, 
from the east to Jerusalem saying where is he that is born king of the Jews for we have seen his star in the east and are come to worship him when Herod the king had heard these things he was troubled and all Jerusalem with him verse 4 and when he, when he had gathered all the chief priests and scribes of the people together, he demanded of them where Christ should be born. And they said unto him, In Bethlehem of Judea, for thus it is written by the prophet, And thou, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, art thou not least among the princes of Judah? For out of thee shall come a governor that shall rule my people, Israel. Hallelujah. Then Herod, when he had privily called the wise men, inquired of them diligently what time the star appeared. And he said, he sent them to Bethlehem and said, go and search diligently for the young child. And when he had found him, bring me word again, that I may come and worship him also. Verse 9. And when they had heard the king, they departed, and lo, the star which they saw in the east went before them, till so it came and stood over where the young child was. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceedingly, exceeding great joy. And when they were come into the house, they saw the young child with Mary his mother, and fell down and worshipped him. And when they had opened their treasures, they presented unto him gifts, gold and frankincense and myrrh. Verse 12, and being warned of God in a dream that they should not return to Herod, they departed into their own country. Their own country another way. Hallelujah. And being warned of God in a dream that they should not return to Herod, they departed into their own country another way. May God bless the reading of his word. Amen.
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our ninth and final scripture is taken from the book of John, chapter 1, verse 1 to 14. And I read, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Two, He was in the beginning with God. Three, All things were made through Him, and without Him was not anything made that was made. Verse 4, in him was life, and the life was the light of men. 5. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. Verse 6. There was a man sent from God, whose name was John. He came for testimony, to bear witness to the light, that all might believe through him. Verse 8. He was not the light, but he came to bear witness to the light. Verse 9. The true light that enlightens every man was coming into the world. Then, he was in the world, and the world was made through him. Yet the world knew him not. 11. He came to his own home, and his own home received him not. 12. But to all who received him, who believed in his name, he gave them power to become sons of God. Verse 13. Who were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of man, but of God. Verse 14. And the word became flesh and dwelt among us, full of grace and truth. We have beheld his glory. Glory as in the only son from the father. This is the word of God.
aje wa ma me wo ato me wo ni amenye me wo ni ameka mi aka mi sebi wa ma ma sebi aye yi re ye yi wa ye na ya ma wo so wa ma me ni aje wa ma me wo ato me mi aka sebi wa mama sebi mi aka me sebi wa mama sebi aye yi re ye yi wa ye na ya ma wo o aye yi re aye yi re Amen. Me, me, 
Amen. Amino. The drama. The drama you are about to watch needs a lot of attention. Hallelujah. And there will be a sound played at the background. So you need to open your ears and your eyes so that you understand anything that we are here to do. We are here to teach, to encourage, to comfort, and to take you into the scripture and spirituality. Amen. Brother Jude, are you ready? Okay. Finally, finally, Peace be unto this house. It's good to see you all. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. Where is your father? Hello, Dad. Hello, my son. It's good to see you. Dad. How have you been? I've been doing well. I wasn't expecting you. You know I'll come at a time that you're not expecting. But it's good that I'm here. It's good to see you. I'm here to inspect your house. But, but, but Dad, next time, can you just I'm let here me already. Know? You should be happy to see me, my son. Where is your body? Go ahead. Speak. Wow. Your body is looking so healthy, so fit, well fed, <laughs> blossoming. I am impressed at you, my son. This is great job here. You're taking into consideration my instructions. I like that. Keeping your body fit. How about your soul? Where is your soul? What? What is going on with your soul? Why is your soul looking so deprived and malnourished and sickly? What is going on? 
Tell me, what have you done to your soul? Perhaps you spent time developing the body, building the body and nourishing the body while you neglect the soul. Have you forgotten that man's body was made from the dust and to dust it will return? You've ignored your soul, the gateway to your life. I'm disappointed at you, my son. I'm disappointed at you. I can't even start to imagine how your spirit would look right now. Where is your spirit? No! Is this the spirit that I deposited into you? You've despised the part of me in you. You've negotiated spirituality for carnality, my son. You've elevated worldliness over godliness. You've invested in bodily exercise and despised spiritual exercise. I am ashamed. I'm hurt, my son. I am hurt. You've despised me and it wasted the investment that I have in you. This is unbelievable, my son. Now, this is my verdict. Because you have done this and wasted the deposit of myself in you and have faced investing in your body, which returns to dust. I'm going to separate your spirit and your soul from your body. <laughs> no. That way you know that bodily exercise, though it profits little, is waste compared to spiritual exercise. This is my decision. Please. And it's irreversible. Please. please don't go. Please. Spirit, please don't do this. Please. Oh. Daddy, body. <laughs> no. Oh. Are you okay? Please. Oh. Please. No. Oh. Oh. Please. Oh. No, Dad, please. Oh. Oh. No. No. No! No! Wake up! My body, wake up! Please! Wake up! I now know that in this life only spiritual things matter every other thing they are all mere costume take a look at my body I invested so much in it is going back to the dust from which it came I prioritized worldliness in the place of godliness my spirit and soul they've all gone i know they will not have a good report of my stewardship please please do not be like me do not be like me i've lived a wasted life the master is coming very soon. Please, my body, wake up! Somebody help. Somebody help. Somebody come help me with my body. Ah. Many of us we concentrate on our body than our spirit. Many of us we feed our body and we reject the soul. But the most important thing is the spirit and the soul not the body. In this church I was sad, sorry, we do a lot of spiritual things. Yeah, Prayer is one of them. Fasting is one of them. Attending to church is one of them. 
though yourself forgot to use you is one of them. And you do all those things. You grow your soul and your spirit. And you know how to grow your soul and your spirit. God will remember you. Thank you all. Thank you all. All we are here to talk about is why do we celebrate Christmas? Or what is Christmas all about? And I'm your host. Thank you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Paris Chapel English in Amount Room, and I'm reporting live from Precious TV Channel 363. I'm your host, Blessing. All we are coming to talk about is why do we celebrate Christmas? What is Christmas all about? Let's go for a quick commercial break. Welcome back for our quick commercial break. We are here to discuss why do we celebrate Christmas? What is Christmas all about? I would like to introduce my panel of guests to you. First on my list, Mrs. Don't Know a Lot. Why do we celebrate Christmas? Well, thank you for inviting me, Osho. Merry Christmas, dear audience. Don't be, fool, don't be fooled by my name because me, I know lots and lots of things. Just ask me the question and I'll give you the right answer. Thank you for making it to my show. Next on my list is Mama Cash. Yes, I'm Mama Cash. You know, say money no be problem. Next on my list, Mrs. Know It All. Thank you for inviting me to your show. Mrs. Know It All. So you only need to ask me good questions. I need six more ones because I know everything. Yeah. Next on my list, Mr. Remember Well. Many opinion, Mr. Remember All. Senior Medicia, Mekai Bibiara, Odia Busame, and Sam Sam, no, Name you are no senior essay. Okay, next on my list, Mr. Sean. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, ne the questions we have. Why do we celebrate Christmas? What is Christmas all about, Mama Cash? As a businesswoman, Christmas is my cocoa season. Jesus Christ was born in Bethlehem. Madam Host, do you know why Joseph and Mary went to Bethlehem? No. They went there to pay taxes to Caesar. Christmas is boring without money. How can you buy bags of rice, chicken, drinks without money? Corona nearly spots our Christmas. So in my opinion, Christmas is all about having fun and spending money. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Mrs. Know It All, um, why do we celebrate Christmas? Christmas is not about money, as she said. It's about food. You see, when Jesus was born, he was placed in a manger. What is a manger? A manger is a cattle-eating trophy. She said, I am in what it did. It's not a do program. I wish to for Eddie Adrian Bebre. In Jan say a mu fo a betier coconte and it's not Thank you. Mrs. Don't know it all. Why do we celebrate Christmas? What is Christmas all about? Well, let me tell you. Christmas is not about money, it's not about food. Let me tell you. 
Christmas is about singing. When Jesus was born in the Bible, eh, they said, angels appeared to shepherds and they began to sing. Oh, come let us adore him. Oh, come let us adore him. Oh, come let us adore in Christ the Lord. So me, eh, I know, not as I think, I know that Christmas is about singing. Thank you. Open you remember, why do we celebrate Christmas? Medawa <laughs> Be a day, a chedia call my yesu. A chedia ni bine, sika koko, me, ene frankincense. O mede call chair yesu. E nuntina e du bronya breswa. Mu papa bronya. Se onam krum no cheche a chedia bite se. Toys, no de cheche nkola. Ene ex mouth boxes. Ewo krum. Thank you. Mr. Sean, he won't be of any help, but at least we could try. Mr. Sean, why do we celebrate Christmas? <laughs> Go on, Mr. Sean. Give us your answer. <laughs> I think he's writing something. Okay, he wrote Christmas and then the five letters of Christmas is Christ. That means Christmas is all about Christ. According to Isaiah chapter 9 verse 6, it says, For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. He's trying to tell us that Christmas is not all about money, nor food, nor singing, or sharing of gifts. Christmas is all about Christ. Dear audience, please have this in mind that we don't celebrate Christmas because you have money or food, or you have items to share. Just bring your mind that Christmas is all about Christ. Thank you. Stay safe. Feeling good tonight, tonight, tonight. I'm feeling good tonight, tonight, tonight. Anywhere I go now, then me holla. Oh, too much money. All over the world, go then me holla. Then they feel me, they love the boy. Oh, 
overtake, 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 dominate, If I start to the top, that is where you need to give me, but I got you be boss, boss. Bless with the flow, right to the beat like that. Got you be boss, boss. You don't make it rain, so I never go wrong. I go follow you, I no go strong. Give the dance, give them praise all my days. Oh my lord, I love you. I give you my praises. Uh, love be amazing. See blessing, 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 see